Hey Bruno Bros, well welcome back to another video. So this workout was very really good, but kind of weird. So I started out with no foot snatches and they were all going pretty routine until I got to what I thought was 100 kilograms. And you'll see me kind of laugh and look at the right side after and that's because I put the 10 pounds on the left side, but not on the right side. So it made it only uh, 210, so what, like 95 kilos. Um, I still did the lift, which is really weird. And I had the extra weight on my weaker side so I don't I don't really know it felt really weird as I was doing the pool and as I went under it but um, I just I guess I just did it I don't really know why um, usually if it feels that off I don't even pull it but I just fully committed to it right there you can see it kind of dipped to the left because it's literally 10 more pounds um, and I added that little caption there I don't know if I'll keep that on since I'm adding this commentary I think it kind of threw me off for this 110 but then I came back and made it and I think it looked pretty fine. It was an odd jump to go from that, uh, especially going from it normally loaded now. The 120 was good. I believe my best ever no foot is 125, or at least something close to that. It's hard to like have a specific number for that because sometimes one of my feet will kind of slide or move to move out and it won't be like a true no foot, but something around there. 120 is always good to get in that complex. I then wanted to do some clean front squat jerk and you'll see something very funny happen um, once I get to 143. So I went from here uh, to 111, and this felt fine. So this is kind of sore when I was doing the cleans of these, uh, like my quad tendons. So they weren't really feeling that great clean-wise, and jerks are feeling all right. But uh, I think I mentioned in the previous commentary, my jerks have been kind of feeling not technically good. Um, so I was really focusing on just that full extension of legs and just trying to, the, be explosive on the jerk. So you'll see here, I do the front squat, and when I come up, the light in the shed is turned off. Sometimes when uh, the dogs are let out, they'll accidentally flip the shed light. <laughs> so I was in darkness for a second, waiting for it to come back on. Um, so you know, I don't want to blame outside factors, but that certainly was it. I I certainly had to wait. I wasn't going to do a jerk in the dark. That seems like a really bad idea. But I came back. Uh, very difficult lift but I was able to get this 145. Uh, uh, there's no reason to repeat 143, so threw the two and a half pound plates on, made it a 320, and then made a very ugly jerk. It was a very ugly clean. The only thing good about the lift was the front squat. <laughs> uh, everything else is really difficult, but that was it for this one. Not really too much to talk about this. I just wanted to point out those two things, uh, the shed light and the mist load there, but that's it for this one. Talk to you all the next one. Peace.